Well, it's bad enough to be in this demonic device, but with everyone fighting at once, it's almost like being in a prison riot. Yeah, and there's so much history behind the Elimination Chamber match itself. A lot of blood, sweat, and tears shed in there. We're in for a good one tonight. Regardless, when Natalia's in the ring, she brings a lifetime of family experience and always delivers. That's the first time she's executed that move. She's experimenting. I like that. I love when a diva experiments. Let's take a moment to talk about Natalia. How's she gonna get it done here? When you're a third generation competitor like Natalia, you know how important every second is in a match. The Queen of Hearts has an abundance of time here to dish out her brand of pain. Let's see what the future holds. Oh, I've been looking forward to seeing these competitors square off for quite some time now, Cole. enters the match. That move should do it. I mean, this should have been over a while ago. Come on, Rap. Yeah, this should be over. With a move like that, she's just trying to insult her opponent. How's that look ferocious? It's like someone hit the repeat button for this move. Yeah. Brutal. Second time around. Seems to work, though. Take it down with a beautiful suplex. See what kind of response we'll get. Yeah, I'm telling you, that suplex was perfect. The power of Natalia. Natalia is defined by her amazing array of skills. She's powerful, agile, and has the technical abilities in that ring that is a mark of the Hart family. Oh, and she's the daughter of WWE legend Jim the Anvil Nightheart. So you know she's fearless and as tough as they come. Eva Marie in a bad way here. When she agreed to this match, she knew this wasn't going to be easy. Well, I don't know if these divas could be any more evenly matched than they are. What a match. Yeah. And these women are so evenly matched. I don't think either one has proven their dominance yet. Oh, that was a serious shot there. We're witnessing a level of punishment that can only be described as severe. No kidding, this is getting ugly. The skills of Natalia are without equal. The Queen of Hearts can go toe-to-toe, -to -toe, exchange holds, and crush an opponent with power moves. But Natalia's not just athletic and beautiful. She's trained in jiu-jitsu, which adds another element to her already intimidating reputation. And you know, Cole, if there's one thing I love, it's a woman that's not afraid to throw a man around. <laughs> oh, but seriously, Natalia's the first... Naomi looking for the pin. Look at this. Man, we got a lot of match left. Natalia beginning to stumble a bit. I'd say her fans have every reason to be concerned here. Look at her. You can actually see her confidence level starting to wane. This competitor certainly knows the value of being bold. I mean, you're just not going to get very far in this business by being a wallflower. No way. Looks like Eva Marie is starting to fade. Her hopes of winning this match may very well be in jeopardy. After witnessing this, I don't think I like her chances very much anymore. Talk about an oversized ego, Cole. Huge. It's almost as big as yours, but I realize you have to be confident to be successful here in the WWE. But this guy is just being ridiculous. She's putting the entire Divas roster on notice here. Naomi looking a little shaken. This is not how she drew this one up. <laughs> Look at these Divas go. Neither one of them are backing down. Absolutely. There's some reason for concern, but hey, I wouldn't count her out just yet. Dana Brooke shows us some clever offense here. Oh, she really likes that move, huh? What was your first clue? Whoa! Can she end it here? Maybe. Her back is in some real pain now. And it's, fun. it's a bolt backbreaker, John. What a finishing maneuver. This could be it. It's got to be it. Oh, man. How do you stand after an attack like this? Make no mistake about it. When you're in this type of combat, the entire ring area becomes chaotic. Could this be it? I think so. Did 
Somebody say deja vu. Once again, this team is utilizing one of her favorite moves. Yeah, we've seen that before, and I have a feeling we're going to see it some more. She slams her down with great force. She's clearly not shy about proving her dominance. Michael, I wonder what she'd think about having me be her arm candy. And that one hit with the force of a big rig. Oh, that's got to hurt. I think she's trying to prove a point here. Eva Marie smells blood. A knockdown drag out brawl complete with a big stomp. Man, these guys are throwing bombs. They're pulling out all the stops. So Bliss looks like she's starting to really show signs of this match. Yeah, and when she goes back and watches this, she's going to point to this portion of the match and wonder what the heck she was thinking. Wow, I was really expecting a better showing for her here tonight. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. She's going to need to dig down deep if she wants to keep going now. Beginning to look bad for her here. She's going to need to find a way to mount an offense here. She keeps going to her finisher, Michael. Quick pin! Hey, is this it? Uh, it may be. Dana Brooke has fire in her eyes now. Oh, she wants this win. She pulls a new trick from her bag with that one. What type of competitor is favored when you step outside the ropes, King? Well, in my opinion, the more vicious, the more destructive person that's willing to do absolutely anything to hurt his opponent, regardless of the consequences, he has the advantage. Oh, uh, look out. She missed her target that time. Yeah, I guess you could say she was just a bit off the mark with that one. One move after the other. It's devastating. This is hard to watch. This is going to be bad. Well, out here, you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. Shipping away at the midsection. This may be turning into a brawl, King. Yeah, just don't bring it over here. Great move. There's no telling what's going to happen here. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. Six of WWE's most alpha. 
multiple personalities all competing in the same match, there's a good chance this one ends deteriorating sooner than later. This is a moment driver. Wow, now that's what you call a finisher. This might be it. Here we go for the win. <laughs> Nikki Bella looking for victory here. I wish she was looking for a date for dinner instead. Could this be it? I think so. And yeah, let's have less night put to an end. Oh man, that'll scramble your insides. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. That may be felt for a lifetime. She's clearly not shy about to look at the attack here. Oh man, talk about a direct hit. She appears to be ah! for her own good. She's gonna have to find a way to defend herself. This six-man match may have taken it all out of her. Wow, those finishers she used earlier seem to have had little effect. That's a good point, John. And let's not overlook exactly how close this match has been thus far. Did somebody say deja vu? Once again, this team is utilizing one of her favorite moves. Yeah, we've seen that before, and I have a feeling we're going to see it some more. I'm so impressed with this Dana Brooke. Here's another one. Go watch this. Dana Brooke on a good pace right now. shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud. And ladies and gentlemen, I think it's safe to say that you just witnessed one of the most historic elimination chamber matches of all time.